Justin Timberlake was arrested for driving while intoxicated DUI on June 18th in Sag Harbor after he allegedly ran a stop sign while driving his BMW X7. Newly obtained police reports revealed detailed accounts of the pop star's failed sobriety tests and refusal to take a chemical test. The 43-year-old singer, who was pulled over shortly after midnight by rookie officer Michael Arkinson, exhibited numerous signs of intoxication, according to the police report. Arkinson's notes indicate Timberlake had bloodshot and glassy eyes. An odor of alcoholic beverage emanating from breath and was unable to follow police instructions correctly. Timberlake initially refused to take a breathalyzer test and failed several field sobriety tests, including the walk and turn and one leg stand tests. Officer Arkinson noted that Timberlake swayed during the tests and struggled with balance. The singer also refused to provide a breath sample at the police station. During the arrest, Timberlake's possessions included a Rolex watch, a black vape pen, a gold ring, and a wallet containing $306 in cash. The report detailed that Timberlake was alone in the vehicle and appeared very unbalanced during the field tests. Following his arrest, Timberlake was rearranged virtually on Friday, where Judge Carl I. Ray suspended his driving privileges in New York. Timberlake, currently on his Forget Tomorrow World Tour in Europe, pleaded not guilty and is scheduled for another court appearance on August 9th. His lawyer, Edward Berg Jr., had sought to dismiss the case, citing errors in the initial charging documents, but was rebuked by the judge for his comments outside the courtroom. Timberlake's case continues to develop as he navigates the legal system amid his ongoing tour.